I'll bet big. I don't think we're going to have a thousand dollars. All right, I'll bet shake you. hands. Hey guys, I'm off the grid for August, but my girl Roseanne is back and laying it out like nobody else. I, I don't even think we're going to have an election, Tim. I don't think we're going to have no election. You want to bet money? I'll bet. How much? Hundred bucks? How much you got? I, uh, not as much as you. <laughs> I'll bet big. I don't think we're going to have a thousand dollars. All right, I'll bet shake you. hands. I hate shaking hands. Go like this. It's worth it. Oh, that was a good one. A thousand dollars. So uh, if we have an election in 2024, you're going to give me a thousand dollars. Uh huh. Okay. Jake, does she have it? Yeah. Does she have, uh, you don't have like a Britney Spears relationship with her, right? She has, <laughs> she has control of her money. I got a thousand bucks, but okay. you're going to have to pay me a thousand when we do not have no I'll, election. I'll, I would be delighted. Well, why, and and why, I'll buy you a nice dinner on top of that. Why you. do you think there won't be an election? Because I think the corruption is just beginning to uh, come out. And I think it's going to avalanche the corruption of the Biden administration and the money they took. First, it's going to be about Ukraine and Russia. Then it's going to go into China. Then it's going to go into but the DOJ. Would, and it's going to be like a big old I, that, that, would, that would prompt an election. Huh? That would prompt an election. No, because I think that uh, it's going to get so bad in the streets, too, that I think the military is going to step in. I mean, Michael, we, we've talked about the... Uh, Many people have come on the show said they, this is like the one time they actually are not convinced there will be an election. That is not to say we hear that every four years. But uh, no, 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 no. Come on. Yes, not we do. Not like now. Not like now. I remember very vividly in Newsmax.com in 2000, they were arguing that Clinton is not going to leave the White House. And they argued that in 2016. Yes. But that's not every single time. This is the Trump, the culture war period. Do you want to yes, end this, this action a, too? This I'll bet $1,000 with you too. I didn't say there wasn't going to be an election. Okay. I'm saying we've had people on the show where we've discussed what is the potentiality? What is the percentage rate of there not being an election? And it's not zero. We had, that's, it's not zero. That's fair. We had an election during the Civil War. We had an election during World War II. So I'm, my, the best predictor of future behavior is history. So if there was precedent for canceling elections, I'd be more receptive to this argument. I don't, th and here's the thing, they don't need to cancel it. Exactly. That's the point. I like know, it's, it's disturbing. Much, it's much better for them to f have a, a, a perception that we, this is, we have a, when Trudeau got reelected, hold on, let me finish my point in one second. When Trudeau just got reelected with the exact same number of seats as previously, he said, oh, I have a mandate. So they will absolutely have the election. Whatever happens, they'll say we have a mandate to do with the F we, we, we need to clarify this. We need to clarify. We need to need to clarify. We need information comes out we need that to proves uh, things that certain people don't think are ever going to be proven. Okay, we need to clarify okay. this bet. Okay. What do you mean by election? Uh, I, I mean um, a, a presidential election. Yeah, people go in and vote. Yeah. Okay, so in 1876, people went in to vote. Yes. And then the president was determined by a committee. No, there were two sets of electors in Florida. I just read a book about this. And they, right. and they, they were, had an election. And, they, and, they, and, and the election didn't matter. It did matter. It just, it was a question of which votes are the ones to count. And you know who, why, who decided which votes to count? Because, yeah, they had, a, they had a conference. And so, and, but and they did, still they, had the election. And they decided, we are going to end Reconstruction. And we're we're going to split this up so that no, we don't have another. That's a historical myth. I'm telling you, I just read a book about this literally like in the last six months. Like so that that's. But what why is that book correct and what I read not correct? Because, okay, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. The point is, I just read a book about this. This has been a historical thing that they cut this deal behind the scenes. It was much more complicated than that. Uh, that that's all I'm going to say. But we, I, I'm not here to argue about 1876. Well, with modern day elections, I'm concerned that there's going to be a dog and pony show, and they're like, hey, everybody voted, and they're like. Hey, but we're just going to go in the back room and count it and yeah. then tell you what the answer is. Like, you're like, dude, show me the votes that's in the public. Thing. Like, there's no, for them right. to actually have military law, it's really hard to put that over. But Brazenly. we might already yes. be under a military law, and a lot of people don't know that we are. Have you sure. seen what your, your average SWAT team looks like? They look just like yeah. special forces.